hey guys welcome back this is MD and this is our guide for making you a billionaire a billionaire with a lot of items as well so this is a very very old a trick uh, which involves online this cannot be done by yourself you need to have a party member or a friend to do this with the more player involved the better so what I'm trying to do is here is I'm trying to create a session where I'm gonna invite my friend so this can only be done in Centuria. This trick cannot be done anywhere else. Both of the players must be here. So if you want to involve more players, make sure that all of them are here in Centuria. When you press the touchpad, you'll see an option to give present. So if people are here, you can press touchpad in Centuria and you'll see that there's an option to give present and you can share items, you can give items to them. Everything, cannot, I mean, we cannot give them everything. For example, the items that you get from Divine Beast cannot be given only specific items like normal items you know that you can find uh, throughout the world like uh, wild roses deal slates and all of these things so i don't recommend uh, sharing everything or giving everything else because like some of the stuff you can actually buy so my advice is to only give the valuable items to them such as like wild roses which are which cost around 1500 so you'll get a lot of money if you sell them and if you duplicate them or such as DS slates or maybe some uh, uh, like meat chunks because they want to like raise their uh, cooking levels and such so to make things easier or my explanation easier for example let's say uh, I have 10 wild roses and my friend has none so what I would do the one the person who has 10 wild roses I would back up my save so I would back up my save and I will give the 10 roses to my friend what he's gonna do is he's gonna save the game and I will load my game or, or load my previous save where I had the 10 roses so now both of us have 10 roses so I'll create another session now my friend joins back and he's gonna give me the 10 roses and I would have 20 wild roses he would go and download his backup save where he had 10 so now I have 20 wild roses and he has 10 right so let's say he's gonna give me the 10 again now I would have 30 wild roses and he would have uh, 0 because he gave it to me what he's gonna do is he's gonna uh, like uh, loads or downloads his backup save where he had 10 so now what we would do I have 30 he has 10 we're both for example I would go uh, and save my game and upload my save where I have 30 wire roses so now what I would do is we are gonna create another session and I'm gonna give him the 30 roses that I have so he would have 40 I would back up my save or load my save where I had 30 and join him again and I would give him 30 again he would have 70 wild roses I'm gonna repeat and give him the 30 roses now he would have 100 wild roses and I'm gonna load my save and he's gonna uh, save his game so I would have 30 wild roses with me he's gonna have 100 wild roses so we can repeat this process back and forth back and forth until we would have 999 and like on all of the materials that we have since we would have 999 both of us will actually save the game or just download me have a backup so now what I would do is for example he has 999 and I have 999 for example he's gonna join me he's gonna give me the uh, I'm gonna sell all of my 999 wild roses I'm gonna get around almost a million and a half something like that and he's gonna give me the 999 roses uh, from his uh, stock so I would have a million and a half and a 999 roses he's gonna uh, like download his old save back it's, it's as if he lost nothing while I I gained one million and a half you know but the thing is this trick uh, never sell I mean this trick is kind of like it's, it's tedious uh, slightly because the items actually cost a lot for example a blue stone cost you around 5,000 uh, Shia so that's that's a lot I mean you I mean uh, how well, you don't need to buy everything but when you want to buy this 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 things this these things you know they cost you a lot so my advice is when you are doing this trick when you are like sharing items between each other 
is you only do it for the valuable items the other items you can actually buy from the shops like for example you can buy eggs and all of these things so only do it for like wild roses the onyx slates you know the rainbow gems glimmer stones black star chunks the items that I found uh, which sell for high or good money are the wild roses uh, the DS slates uh, the black star chunks these items they sell high so yeah and and the other items like up to slate so these are the rare items so maybe if you want to like if you're short on, on dyes you can share the blue stones the black stones and these items as well the reason that I'm telling you to, to only share the, the valuable items is because because sharing takes a lot of time really and if you guys are four involved in this and three of the guys would save their game and give the items to one player and then they load their games this is gonna be huge this is gonna make things way 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 faster so what I would suggest is you guys drop your like IDs uh, in the comments below create a party of four or more again a lot of money as well as a lot of amount of like items such as 999 or 500 from each of the items at least you know the other items and at the same time even if you have the money just just in case have a backup of 999 wild roses just in case you want to double your money you can as easily do it you don't have to repeat this whole process so if you would have the 999 for example like now even though I can I will sell these I'm just waiting for my friend so I'm gonna sell the items that I have here uh, the 99 wild roses and he's gonna give them back to me before he leaves so in this case even though I sold everything I would still have the 999 wild roses and he would have his money as well so yeah uh, if you don't do this then we have to repeat the whole process which is gonna take you like an hour or two to do actually of, of repeating this but since we would have a copy of or each of us would have a 999 in their inventory we can do this trick anytime where we are low on money or low on Shia so this is really really useful like I said like some of these items even though you can buy them and we which can make the process easier they cost a lot so a, a million Shia is nothing so this trick would actually help you with the trophy that you have where you need to get one million and to be honest when I finished this game even with the wild roses that I had I didn't reach around 1000 or 100,000 Shia so it's gonna be a lot of grinding unless you do this it's also gonna help you with the for example dyes the the cooking recipes especially if you have the meat chunks and everything else uh, the crafting or synthesizing or upgrading your items or weapons to max you don't have to worry about like going and grinding and finding materials again uh, you don't have to worry about getting wild roses or, or having the money to upgrade your weapons or having to worry actually to like hey should I back up my save or, or not before I, I, I what's it called I'm gonna like create a new weapon or I'm gonna uh, do do anything you know or forge a new weapon you don't have to worry about that you can just experiment the way you want and whenever you low on money or items just ask the friend and, and copy each other's items and you're gonna be done as you can see here I'm just gonna go to a materials shop and, and let's see let's see the items they have like look 3,000 5,000 so this thing if I buy 999 it's gonna cost me around what it's gonna cost me around like 5 million or something to buy all of these or have 999 uh, wild roses so this is ridiculous actually <laughs> so you would have to sell the the wild roses five times to afford buying uh, around 1,000 uh, blue stones. Look how ridiculous the prices are in this game. So this is why this is why this trick is gonna like solve a lot of problems. Uh, the sad part is is that you cannot do this or do this uh, with the rare materials, like the the items that you get from the bosses or even the weapons. I think so you can only do this uh, with the materials that you can find in the world like I said so my suggestion would be like I said here is only do this uh, for the wild roses and the other material expensive materials as well as the materials that do not spawn a lot or the materials that you cannot buy from this, the, the shops uh, such as the bone and meats or the the chunks such as these items otherwise for example, uh, you're gonna uh, waste time uh, sharing uh, uh, like normal flowers or an item that you can buy from the shop. Then that's uh, really a waste of of your of your time. 
but yeah guys uh, this is it and uh, just drop your IDs below in the comments and try to help each other with this and as always thanks for watching thanks for liking and stay awesome guys